Hi guys, my name is Priscilla Quintana. I'm here with Telemundo for my exclusive interview on Based on a True Story. Ruby? Uh, Ruby. Ruby. Nathan. Hi. Hi. Oh my goodness. I didn't know you'd be here. I didn't know you'd be here either. So uh, good to see you. Oh, it's good to see you. Uh, um, here, babe. Hey, did hey. You, uh, oh, is this for me? Did you meet Matt? Is everyone met. Oh yeah, we're old friends, right? She thought we were having a three-way. I did. I do. What? She's pregnant. Really? Yeah. That's that's the reason why we're not. I would say that we both kind of gravitate towards being the life of the party, bringing people together. We know how to have a great time. And we're both definitely obsessed with true crime. That did not happen for me after the show. I have been obsessed. So, yeah, I mean, this this job was a dream come true because of that. I would say that Ruby might have more of a difficult time um, keeping her relationships strong. She can be a little bit selfish, and I tend to be very selfless in my relationships and my friendships. And also, I don't live in a $30 million mansion. And she does. <laughs> you know, we'll get there, maybe. Oh my goodness, that's such a good question. I would say, you know what? Besides being obsessed with true crime, I'm also obsessed with the ocean. I love learning about everything under the ocean. So. I've been recently diving into Mariana's Trench. I'm so fascinated with it. So maybe it would be me exploring unexplored parts of the ocean because I think like 75% of our oceans have not been explored yet. So it would just be me finding weird fish and showing you guys. On a scale of one to 10 at Solving Mysteries, I'm a solid nine. I should be part of the CIA. You know, I've listened to enough crime podcasts that I know not like what not to do, but to be honest, I cannot even kill a spider in the house. I, you know, if there's even like an annoying fly, I'm like, oh, you'll be dead in three days. Like just keep flying around. So I wouldn't be able to commit one, let alone get away with one, but I could solve one 1000%. Working with Kaylee was amazing. When I first got hired, she actually called me and she's like, we're gonna go hiking, we're gonna be best friends. So she took me on a hike, we hung out, she was amazing. And yeah, she kind of acted as a big sister in a sense because she has so much experience. So it was really, really great to work opposite of her because it was kind of like taking a master class in a way. Just being able to study her and watch her. She's so organic. She's so amazing. Yeah, it was like taking a master class that I didn't have to pay for. They actually paid me, so it was great. <laughs> Best case scenario. I think that we all created amazing friendships on and off camera, and I think that you can see how close we all are on camera like we're so comfortable with each other it flows so easily the dynamics are so funny and so hilarious the characters complement each other so well the writers did an amazing job so i think people can really look forward to just seeing us work together and how much we genuinely really really like each other i have no idea how you can multitask right now okay babe, listen to me i know you're freaking out okay it is all gonna be fine trust me guys if you're a fan of murder true crime dark comedy, satire, and amazing actors. Kaylee is phenomenal, Lee is phenomenal, Chris and Tom are fantastic. Watch the show, we can't wait to hear what you guys think. <laughs>